ladies and not ladies. I am here to inform you that I am holding my geometry homework. I'm also here to inform you that I just threw it on the floor and it fell on my head, which is not what I intended. This is EYE Divine Cybermancy. It is a relatively new game, so I decided I'll get a jump on it. I'm gonna do some solo. Um, something interesting about this game is whether you play multiplayer or solo, your character is the same, so you can upgrade him in either one, then use him in either one. Alright, this is Kravach. I, I just told you, dude, you're in Kravach. No, not, not dream, it's Kravach. Here. He's dead. My bad. Hey, uh, let's see as you can tell from my level 17, um, which is my age. That's how this game goes. Um, whatever age you are just determines your level. It makes the whole leveling system a lot more fair to people. Um, yeah, let's go through the Oblivion Gate. Whoa. It is loading, which is, I suppose, a good thing. Because if it wasn't loading, then that'd be bad. I, um, this is the planet of Oblivion. They've actually cleaned up quite a bit. straight to another armory that's not listed. If you're having trouble hearing me, that is because I'm using a Nintendo 64 mic. You're saying that's bullcrap because Nintendo 64 didn't have live parties or anything. Well, it did have a game called Hey You Pikachu, which was badass. And there. Uh, let's see. This is the armory. As you can see, I have the Maculis, which is a two-handed melee weapon, and a sword, if you didn't notice. There is a battle axe that I do not have yet. Um, dual katanas. Um, I had those equipped at one point, I unequipped them recently. I right, on to guns. These are actually only handguns, but, you know, they still kill people, I guess dual wield and a magnum. I have the dual wield. Um, this is pretty powerful. They're all pretty powerful, I guess, if you shoot people they die. This is a submachine gun, VHS-10 or 010, not to be confused with the shotgun. Um, it fires very fast and has horrible accuracy. I use it because I already have horrible accuracy, so it won't be much of a difference. Shotguns I've never used, but this is the Betty Boom and the Depthsator. Dep Looks like a Spanish name that I cannot pronounce. I felt Spanish, so yeah. On to snipers. Uh, this one is the, Vind the Vindico. Attack AD. It's very powerful, very slow fire rates, excellent accuracy, 5 round capacity, very heavy recoil, shot for shot, 2 times zoom. You could, probably could have read all of that, but too bad. I have to fill this commentary up with something. There's also the Bosco, which is we had Chaz a built in silencer, so that's pretty handy. Semi automatic. Um, it's pretty good, I use it. I used to use this one. And then I realized if you shoot someone in the head, they die regardless. So I go with this one. It takes up 
little bit less room and it has a built-in silencer, which is very useful, as I already said. Cell rifle, I have not used any, but I put one in my inventory just for this. So we'll see how that works. I know most of you people are assault rifle type of people. There's the rock to mound and the KA-93. I'm using the KA-93, obviously. Why? I have no idea. But it seems to be slightly more powerful and just a little bit better in every regard. It's got semi-automatic and full automatic. Which you can really ever change in games, so that's cool. Heavy. This has a freaking scope on it, I guess. One time zoom. Technically, that shouldn't change anything, but... I'm just gonna go with what it says. It fires this very, very small clip of ammo. So, yeah. But each clip holds 500 rounds, so... However they do that, I don't know. Maybe it's pencil shavings. And here is grenades, which look nothing like grenades. These are things that I don't know. Actually, that's a sentry. Kind of looks like tweezers, but it's a sentry. This, I'm assuming, is armor of some sort. Maybe. A mask, I don't know. This is a syringe, or med kit, which heals you. I'll get more into that later. And that's all the weapons there is currently. They might still release more. It's still just been released, like I said earlier. I think. Maybe. Um, you can choose your armor type anywhere throughout the game as long as you're in armory. Light, medium, and heavy. They don't allow you to carry any more items, but... Well, obviously, heavier armor, stronger but it slows you down. See this malice? That's your speed. And it's at pretty much negative. You have about 7% speed right there. This is about 29% speed. And 49% speed. I am horrible at math. That's why through my geometry I'm working on the ground. I stick with medium because Everyone likes to be pretty much medium, so. Uh, weapons, which I'll, I just explained, but so you get a better idea. You can dual wield swords and pistols, which is very useful. Sword here, then pistol here that I won't shoot because I have very low ammo. If you look on the bottom right, it shows my ammo, and it's not very high. The HS-010. single sword. You can charge them. As far as I know it doesn't take any energy actually, so that's useful. Assault rifle that I've not used before. So and I guess it's toggle zoom. Doesn't really matter to me too much. Um grenade. It's a very complicated process to throw a grenade. You gotta look at this computer on your arm and it's all on that's not even actual Japanese writing, it's their own language. So, first after you discern their language you get to figure out how to actually throw a grenade. The syringe, um, you noticed, it says it has 56 ammo. That's because it'll heal that amount of health, or 56% or something along those lines. Um, but it recharges. I just healed myself even though I had full health. But as you can see, it recharges. But you have to have it out for it to recharge, so don't just go run around and be like, hey, it's recharging, then you die, and find out it's not charging. Like I am about to do. This is another sword, it's the same sword, Democules, but it's completely different for some reason. I have no idea. It really confuses me. And dual pistols. So let's get going. This is aim. He, he gives you side missions, I guess. Um, Commander Rimana is over here. Put me to roll. Put me their own language. The developers designed it so it'd be more in depth. Kind of like if you've ever played a Final Fantasy game or 
I guess Banjo Kazooie even works if you played that. Let's press enter on him. I have no idea what the hell this is about, but we'll find out. Well done. Our mission in New Eden is a complete success on every level. Cyberbrain has been captured. The Federation has been defeated. And above all, your mentor betrayed himself, falling into our trap. By the way, tell me what really happened out there, soldier. Well, you have options to talk, but they only give you one option, so yeah. Once the cyberbrain was captured, my mentor read the data it contained, and he sent me to grab a briefcase. A briefcase? And what did contain? Typo. They need a lot more work on this. But I don't know. I just scanned it and directly sent the inf information to my mentor. Hmm. I wonder what the hell the old bastard found. And what he's preparing. Therefore, we'll send you on a mission without him. Don't worry, we'll keep him busy by assigning him other unimportant tasks. What ca You'll go to an ancient colony located within a looter stronghold. Officially, you must infiltrate the outpost to get close to their chief, a warlord of some renown. Unofficially, you're there to steal some data. What kind of data can they own which would interest us? Those roaches probably stole some secret documents from a Gian spaceship during a pirate raid. A majority of these scumbags have been eliminated, but some survivors managed to escape with data. Where do I go? When you're fit for duty, come back to me when you're ready. Okay. Well, I'm going to show you a couple things about the HUD and then end this, then actually show you some gameplay. Because this video is probably going to be really long. I, um, on the bottom right, next, right above my ammo, you'll see another yellow sphere that has shadows in it, I guess. And if you've ever watched Naruto, this is probably a complete ripoff, but it has the exact same sound effect. And you make clones of yourself. Three clones, supposedly, but... I guess the third one forgot how to be summoned. Um, they can take a couple shots. Not too many, though. Um, dead. And they sound explosive when you kill them, but 